Well, to be honest, when I first heard Pastor James up on the stage saying he was looking for 300 new people to walk through the doors of this church over the Christmas period, I thought that is a tall order. And my hand, my hand in my heart, I thought, I didn't think we'd be able to achieve it, you know. But then I'm usually quite keen to pray into everything. And if that's Pastor James's vision, I said to myself, if that's the vision, then I'm going to pray on it and I'm going to try my best. And that's when I decided to try and get 30 tickets sold. And I thought I'll try my best to get as many new people through the door as possible. But I knew I wouldn't be able to achieve that myself. So I decided to go into Facebook and ask everybody to pray for me. And even around my family and my workplace, I said to people, I'm trying to sell 30 tickets, can you pray for me? And I know that um, people have prayed for me and I've started to sell tickets. I really believe that we could achieve it between everybody in the church. Now that I've managed to um, sell 70 tickets myself, I definitely think it's attainable. Um, it seemed like a lot at the time, but I don't really think it's a lot because there's a lot of things going on in this church over Christmas and New Year. We've got the carol service, we've got the film night, we've got um, Cafe Church and Message Church. We've, we've, I've got, myself, I've got the Good Friends group for the single people. There's just so many events taking place. I'm positively sure we will more than get 300 people through the door. I think it will be easy for us to get it. And I say that confidently now because I already started a couple of weeks ago selling the tickets. So I'm ahead of the game, if you like, because I had already started. But I think if other people start and just even ask a few people, then it will be easy, definitely. Easy. Between my family and my workplace, I've already got 33 people that have not been in this church already. So that's just me. And I'm continuing to sell tickets. So I'm really hopeful that for myself, I would like to reach 50. Um, and I just believe that if other people in the church just reach out to people that they don't even think will come, but even just to, even just to ask the question, but people need to help, people need to ask, even if it's just ask your family, ask your friends, ask the people, ask the people in your circle. And like have, it's handy to have some tickets on you, you know, tickets are handy. Because it means then, if you've got a ticket and somebody's willing to buy a ticket, you can give them it there and then. And it's only five pounds. I mean, you can't buy anything for five pounds these days. And children go, free, go for free if they're under the age of 12, which is absolutely excellent. And the reason it's so cheap is not because it's not a very good show, it's because I know that Pastor James wants people to come through the doors of the church so that they can experience what we experience, which is a really good time at Christmas time. And I know it will be brilliant. From my heart, I know it will be a brilliant show. Within my workplace, to be honest, I was a wee bit kind of wary about inviting certain people. But then I decided to ask the admin staff if they would send an email. I thought, send an email through the three departments. And I just prayed, even if a couple of people respond for each department. So I didn't have to ask anybody. The email went out and then certain people came back and they responded to it. So that, was, that made it easier for me. Um, within my family, I decided to text because I thought that uh, within my family, people will text back and they'll say yes or no, and I'm not putting any pressure on anybody. And to be honest, I was really delighted when my young sister said yes, she was bringing her whole family, because she's never been here to this church before. And she said, I'll have three tickets and two free for the kids. And I was so happy, thank you, Lord, I was delighted for that. Um, and then there was other members of my family that I just met face to face, and I had the tickets, and I said, how do you fancy coming to this show? It's going to be really good. The one thing for me is, I'm quite busy. Most people know I have a really busy lifestyle and I have lots of friends and I have lots of family. And for me, it's great if they can come to the show because that'll be a time that they can spend with me. It'll be a happy memory. We'll be able to talk about the show and I know that they'll really, really enjoy it. So it's trying to fit people into a kind of busy lifestyle. My, and if my friends and my family come here, then they fit into the things that I love. I know they'll have a brilliant time. I just know it. And I am so delighted. I cannot believe it that between my work and my family, 40 people are going to walk through this door. You've got the carol service, you've got all the stuff that's happening in Tory Glen. Um, you've got Messy Church, you've got Cafe Church. You, there's just so many things going on. I definitely believe, my hand in my heart, I really believe it.